sense? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to move on. I'll lead on. Shuffle's going to bring up the rear, go through the park, <coughs> play the gears a bit, and then off to the junction of the shuffle. Hello, um, my name is Marie Hayes and I started off uh, doing the introductory course at Handsworth. It was introduced to me by a friend because she knew that I wanted to improve my confidence in riding. Not that I couldn't ride, I just wanted to improve my confidence. Um, I have done that and so leading on from that now I've embarked upon a level 2 which is to improve my confidence a little further because um, level 2 involves going on road which is something that I've never really done before. Communication, give a signal, so that's the communication, observation, communication, control. Look at the road positions, controlling everything. Now that you've got around her, it's control. Okay, look, quick look behind and then moving towards the curb as close to the curb you can get and stop. Yeah, look both sides. It's safe to do a U turn. I think it's, it's very important because you find a lot of cyclists on the road who are not particularly aware of the uh, Green Cross Road uh, for, for cyclists and I think if many more cyclists were aware of uh, the, you know, the ethics of it and the codes then they'll be more careful on the road and they'll be um, more aware of how they're supposed to conduct themselves and make it easier for drivers and also as a driver now that I'm learning how to cycle on the road it's making me more um, have more empathy for when I see cyclists on the road. as well on bike maintenance um, pumping up the tires because I don't feel that confident having my own bike if I don't know how to maintain it if you know if the tire goes flat while I'm out cycling and if I have a puncture or whatever I feel like I need to learn the skills of maintaining the bike